Good morning, friends. Okay, let's talk about transitioning from a uh, bassinet to a pack and play or crib. When folks ask me this question, they're kind of telling on themselves, and I'll tell you why. And I can, I can look at this. He keeps waking up when moving around and can't fall back to sleep. So this tells me immediately that your child is being assisted to sleep. And unfortunately, until the assistance to sleep stops, the waking will happen whether or not your baby is in a bassinet or out of a bassinet. Now the bassinet in this case may be providing some swaddling effects, meaning that your baby is so big that they can't really move or they feel comforted when they do move and they're able to go back to sleep. But that also tells me that this is a safety risk and we need to get this kiddo out of the bassinet. So the only real answer to connect sleep here is to stop assisting to sleep. When you stop assisting to sleep, you are going to have protest. And when you have protest, you need to have a plan. We can help with that. We have the Slumber Party podcast um, on iTunes, Spotify, anywhere you listen to podcasts to kind of help you through some of that. Um, unfortunately, there is no way around the, the protest part, um, but that's the answer to your question. Hope it helps.